Okay, so this module uh, creates a simple select query. Uh, this select query displays data for both the entrepreneur table and the public representative table. Um, therefore, it's a join query, and this query uses table aliases. So table aliases are declared in the public clause. So E represents entrepreneur, and P represents public representative. So when we say E dot entre F name, it means take the entre F name from the entrepreneur table. When we say P dot F name, it means take the F name the public representative table. Now because this is a join query, we need to ensure that each row of data is only displayed once. So in the where clause we say where e to entre id is equal to p to entre id. If we didn't if we didn't have that um, each row of data would be displayed twice, once for the entrepreneur table and once for the public representative table. But because we have that in now it'll only be displayed once where the entre ID in the entrepreneur table matches the entre ID in the public representative table. So that concludes this video. Thanks for watching.